Hi vlog, we are starting a new one here. This is me getting back on track for the next week before I fly to LA. I, if you guys haven't seen, I've been traveling for the past like three weeks. I was in Florida with my friends and then I went to Arizona for two weeks with my family. Um, and I got home last night and today I literally just like took down all my Christmas decorations and um, caught up on emails and worked out and slept in and recovered. And now it's 10.30 on Friday night and I'm unpacking from three weeks, weeks worth of traveling. So, uh, I have like no groceries, but like I can't really go grocery shopping too much because like I leave again on literally Wednesday and it's Friday night. Um, so I'm just trying to get my life together quickly in a couple days before I go on a huge trip to LA, which I'm really scared about and excited at the same time. Um, and it's just a lot of traveling lately and just my life's just been like crazy recently, so. We're just gonna do a vlog this week of me getting ready for this because guess what? I'm bringing Taylor and I'm so excited. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. This is the this is the start of me unpacking because I obviously have to do this before I pack for LA. So live, laugh, love that. But I did convince Taylor to go to LA with me, and I'm so excited, you guys. I'm literally so excited. And Rachel's gonna be there. All my friends from like Raw Gear. It's for like the Zoo Culture Grand Opening. And we're all getting like a really cool air. Oh, it's gonna be so fun. I'm just so freaking excited because I've never been to LA. Um, but oh my god, I just like can't. I cannot <laughs> with this. I want to cry. So much stuff. Hmm. It's okay. We're gonna get through it. I'm gonna play some Crime Junkie and I'm gonna unpack. Wish me luck. Okay, guys. Chore number one of getting ready for LA nails. We got, we the, got same the same color. Same color, different shape though. <laughs> different shape. Shout out Taylor's mom for getting my nails for me. That was so sweet. Now we're at the mall because Taylor needs to buy makeup because the girl I'm owns none. I'm 21 and I'm buying my first foundation. <laughs> we're at the mall and we're gonna go. I'm gonna help Taylor pick up makeup even though I'm, I'm a step above Taylor when it comes to makeup. Like I know the basics, but I'm no pro at that. Like I really, I know the bare minimum. A color match. We just need to get her some foundation and then we'll see. Probably just gonna rely on the workers. <laughs> Update you guys. <laughs> Her hands are literally covered. You probably can't even see it. No, you can't because she's the lightest shade of everything. <laughs> but I'm putting her on my makeup. Look at her, I'm so proud. But <laughs> this is so funny. We put another foundation on her bill. Like, guys, one. I was like, you can try this one out. And then it was like really shiny. She got like, I don't love that. She goes, no, I actually ate it. It was so funny. <laughs> had to be there. Um, and then we were trying to do our lip oil. They don't have the color I want, but they had like one that the worker recommended that was Why closed. are you leaving that on your hand? Oh, it's you, it's oily. And we literally put on a, per like the tester of this, we put on a perfume stick and then started rubbing it on our lips. It's so funny. Oh, uh, we're a mess, uh, but. This is going well, I feel like. Are you gonna get this Except stick? For, guys, I'm so scared when I put this on and all the colors are wrong. I don't think they will be. You're getting like the lightest shade. Right. She's <laughs> <laughs> getting a spray tan. I don't know. I feel like you can bronze everything out, right? Yeah. Right? <laughs> guys, so if you see me looking like an idiot, just tell me I look good. <laughs> <laughs> they don't even have this. Oh no. You can only get the dark one. Guys, we've been swatching these Fenty Beauty cream contour sticks. <laughs> Literally, we put three or four different ones on our hand. I'm like, I like this one. And then we didn't remember what, what it was. And then we put them all back on her. And then we couldn't figure out what it was. And now we're just really lost and don't know <laughs> what it is. I really like this. It looks really pretty. I said $40. Middle of the mall right here, right now. I $40. Live Let's review. Oil. Let's test her out. Oh, yeah, oh she's juicy. <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> Mm. I like that we're in the middle of the wall. It's like minty. What are, you, what are we thinking? I don't know, do you want some? Mm hmm <laughs> <laughs> No way. <laughs> no way we're doing this in <laughs> Oh my god, it's going fast. <laughs> I just want you to let it know. I just want you to know that that was fully in the middle. <laughs> <laughs> um, update. It's really smooth and nice and soft. I'm curious what the color is gonna look like. What do, what do you guys think? <laughs> <laughs> you can't believe that. So okay. Funny. 
Um, we'll keep you updated on how long it lasts because yeah. that's my real, um, you know. Okay, I can anyway. return it. I have 30 days. Yeah, 30 days. <laughs> return it. 62 exchange colors. Hi vlog. It is Monday morning. Um, and I am doing so many errands today to kind of get stuff done before I go. I just got my lashes and brows done. I feel like a new woman because it's been a minute. They're a little red still because I literally just got home like 10 minutes ago, but looking for i feel like it just like lifts your face almost like it just like makes me look alive I feel so much like better like i feel like i don't need makeup in a sense does that make sense to you guys just a little more confident when my brows and lashes are done <laughs> but now i'm running to my parents house dropping off one of my mom's christmas presents dropping off a suitcase that i used of theirs in arizona picking up some extra stuff and then i've turned to the bank and i'm trying to decide if i should get a pedicure because i got my i got a manicure with taylor but i'm like doing i really do need to get my toes done but it's like i really don't want to like take the time and do that but like and then I'm like, how much are my feet even going to be out? Like, I always have socks on because I hate feet. But I'm like, what if? What if for some reason, like, I need a pedicure? So I'm, like, really debating on if I go do that or not. So we're going to go run some errands and I'm going to come home and get some work done. Okay, so I am just running errands. Just ran to my mom's, ran to the bank. And now I'm going to go get a pedicure quick. I decided I'm just going to do it. My mom's like, it literally really doesn't take that long. Like, you'll be happy you did. Because I needed one before. I went to Florida and Arizona and I didn't get one. And I just have a thing with feet and toes. And I'm like, whatever. So we're going to go do that quick. But I'm going to have it stack. I have two books in my bag. I have the one Colleen Hoover book that I'm reading. But then I also have this David Goggins book. So I might read one of those. Um, if I have time after writing out like when i film my podcast i like rough draft like an outline and my next podcast idea oh there's little hair hanging there rough, um is like my do's and don'ts or my ins and outs of 2023 and um so i'm gonna like draft that up think like brainstorm ideas and i'm also gonna look on pinterest for like outfit inspo for this trip because i want to like have cute little outfits you know that i pack and stuff and just like prep and organize i'm gonna use that time wisely instead of just like scrolling on social media that's the new like goal of mine too is to just be less on mindlessly on social media which honestly i don't i'm on my phone a lot like my screen time is terrible but a lot of it is like when i'm making content editing filming like stuff for work um a lot of it isn't just mindless scrolling but i feel like recently i've been doing more of that so i'm just being a little more self-aware and doing less of that now and so yeah i'm gonna just do that while i get the toes done then i'm going to uh, go home get some work done and i think maybe start packing a little bit yeah i feel really productive it's only 12 15 and i've already gotten my lashes done worked out um went to the bank i'm just doing a lot and i'm feeling great and productive and i love it okay guys um so tonight i started pack well it's monday night i leave wednesday night i started packing Honestly, I got a lot of packing done. Um, like, all this is always how I do, like, day by day kind of thing. So, I have, like, my three main gym fits. I don't even know if we'll go to the gym, like, three times. I don't really know what our plans are. But I know, obviously, we'll for sure be there for the grand opening. So, I have three of those. Oh, my gosh. Sorry, I'm so tired. So, I have three of those. And then I have a lot of, like, day fits. Because I don't know if we'll, like, go out and venture. I don't know if they'll want to, like, go out. I don't really know. Um some comfy clothes and i'm gonna do the rest tomorrow once i know more about like what we're gonna do but it was a good start i'm proud i got that done yeah and then today i filmed a podcast and edited and uploaded it not uploaded but like got it ready to go a youtube video um I'm trying to get ahead of work because it'll just be craziness when i'm there so getting prepared planning ahead of time and yeah but today was good i got so much done today and i feel really good and I'm gonna lay in bed and watch Ginny and Georgia. <laughs> All right, guys, we leave tomorrow um, to head to Chicago, Taylor and I. And so it's Tuesday morning, it's like 12:30, and I'm going over to Taylor's house to help her pack. I packed last night. I kind of showed you guys what I have packed, and Taylor's like, "I need your help." So I'm gonna go over there, help her pack, and then she's gonna come to my house tomorrow. And then what we like don't find in her closet, we're just gonna use of mine because I have so many like extra active wear and clothes and whatever. So I'm like, you can use whatever of mine that you need. So I packed last night, got the stuff I needed, and she can have whatever she like. She gets free right now. I told her in my closet, I don't care. So I'm driving over to Taylor's to do that right now. And then I'm trying to think if I need to run any errands while I'm out. Um, I don't think I do, because I feel like I kind of got all that kind of stuff done yesterday. But, you know, we may just run to Target for funsies, because I haven't been there in a couple of weeks, honestly, since before Arizona and Florida. So, yeah, but... 
I can't believe like we leave tomorrow night. Like we're almost 24 hours out, baby, from this trip. And Taylor and I are gonna have so much fun. I'm so excited, but I need to get going because she's gonna kill me. I'm supposed to be there right now. So I'm like surprisingly late. Okay, <laughs> guys, Taylor and I just spent the last like hour, maybe. It didn't take us that long, I don't think. I feel like it wasn't even an hour. No, and we got all of her outfits ready to go. All of her gym fits, shoes, travel fit, everything, night fits, lounge fit. Should I bring that tank top for anything? This, that one? Yeah, you, know. you could. I always, I'm an overpacker, so I pack everything extra. So maybe pack it. I don't know. Where's my room? <laughs> I'll put it back to you. My fucking chair that my mom's got here. <laughs> I have another one over there. You want it? Oh, you have matching ones. That's Anyone so wants cute. Anyone to buy the clothes underneath it, let me know. <laughs> For sale. Um, but <sighs> yeah, so we just got that done. I'm gonna go home and, uh, I need to try on all of her outfits, all my outfits, and then Taylor's coming over tomorrow to finish. There's a few things of mine that she's gonna wear, but proud of Yay. us. We literally leave tomorrow. That was so easy. I don't even think. Have you announced that you're going, Taylor, to anyone? Like, have you told anyone? I haven't told anyone nope. that you're going. I tomorrow in the car. Like, what the fuck? Tomorrow in the car. I think we should just be like <laughs> surprise. Surprise! I'm so oh excited. God. We leave tomorrow. Night. I need to finish packing. I really do. Are you like pretty much done though? Yeah, but I want to like try everything on and make sure I like it and then actually pack it. Yeah. Because that like kind of takes time in itself. That's one thing I like about carry ons, I don't have to worry about how much it weighs as long as yeah. it fits in there. Uh, Jake's carry on, when we came home from Arizona, was the same weight as his full on suitcase. No way. Yes, 39 pounds. Oh my god. 39 pounds. My brother's <laughs> small carry on. Had like the expander on it, like it was huge, but then, yeah. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. I'm like, what the heck? So. I think, yeah, you'll be just fine. I'm getting a checked bag. She's doing, I'm bringing a carry-on, and then she's just using two carry-ons. Save myself 70 bucks, y'all. Yeah. Balling on a budget. Mm. Not really, but I like to pretend. <laughs> like you didn't just spend all this money on the flight and stay. It's going to be so fun, though. I'm so excited. I feel like I, like, didn't pack enough. But that's just, like. But we're really only there for three full days. I know. That's so that's, like, a lot. Like, we don't wear myself. all those clothes in three days. Yeah. On a typical day, but okay, guys. I'm at Target. I'm gonna grab a few things like checks and who else knows what. A lot of like the travel mini. I like a lot of like the mini travel size stuff. So I'm just gonna look through all that and see what I, I really don't need anything. But I actually like, kind of wanted to come, so I have gift cards. So we'll see what I find. But yeah. Okay, guys. I'm back at Maddie's for the second time this week, and we just did like a blowout and a tr couple treatments on my hair, right? Yeah. And then she curled it for me because she's the best, and it literally like, I needed that so bad. Like my hair feels like I wish you guys could feel my hair. It feels so good and healthy, and oh, I just like I can't do this to my hair. Only Maddie can, so shout out her. But now I'm gonna go home and finish packing. But that was oh, the best feeling ever. Like I can't even explain it to you guys. I really can't. Hi vlog! Okay, so I haven't really talked to you much all day because my mom came over. She's like, we swapped cars because I'm driving her car to Chicago and then she's just gonna have mine while I'm gone. And then we were like chatting for a while, then Taylor came over to go through some of my stuff and I don't even think I vlogged. Did I? I don't remember. Um, anyway, I just kind of finished up my packing. Um, I think my suitcase is gonna be a little too heavy, but I think I can shove some stuff into Taylor's bag, I'm hoping. And then, yeah, I can't believe it taylor's working right now she works till seven and then we're heading out so a few hours to kind of just get my apartment situated i guess i kind of have like a routine of like what i do right before i leave like i take out the trash and like do the laundry the dishes all that kind of stuff so i'm gonna put away my laundry right now and then i'm gonna go unload the dishwasher take out the trash and then kind of get everything else situated that i have going on in here um my carry-on i always i like bring my laptop and all my like cameras and chargers and that kind of stuff and then i always bring like like on these kind of trips, like gym trips and stuff, I bring like a one gym fit and then I'll have like this because I'm wearing this to like drive tonight. So I'll put that back in my like carry on tomorrow and then I have my like airport fit in my bag right now. So that's the plan. I'm so excited to go. I'm really, really excited and I'm going to meet like some girls I've been dying to meet like Nikki Font. Um, she lives out in like California, so she'll be there with some of her friends. It's so fun because like I'm never gonna meet these girls and so I'm excited. She's just like I, Like friendships I already have online like you can actually meet in person is like such a cool feeling and experience. So 
Can't wait. And Taylor's coming, and it's just gonna be such a good time. But there was a big scare this morning. Oh my god, I didn't even tell you guys. Hold up. Literally, listen. So I got up this morning at 4:45 to, or actually, I'm not gonna lie, I hit snooze so like five. But I got up and went to the gym because I had my hair appointment at nine, and I wanted to like work out and shower and eat before. So I did that. Was at the gym with Taylor, and our friend Joey texted us, and he was like, "One, we had like a one Airbnb." Airbnb booked and then we ended up like switching Airbnbs because we thought we were getting scammed and <laughs> it's a whole thing But um, we switched it and then like the whole thing. I'm sure you guys might know about it but like the Entire like all the airlines canceled flights this morning and like stopped because there was some like issue with the software And it was like really scary and they apparently they've been done that since like 9-11 So I was scared. I'm like, oh my god, is it even a good idea to be like traveling like there's like a lot of things like circulating TikTok right now and it's kind of making me nervous because I'm like I'm gonna be in two of the busiest airports in the country LAX and O'Hare so I'm like nervous but I'm just gonna keep watching the news and watching all that and like keep up to date with it and just make sure it's safe and smart but that happened and now Joey and his sister can't come for like other reasons so it's just kind of like stressful today but it's still gonna be so fun I'm still so excited and yeah but I'm getting tired because I woke up so early but I'm gonna go, I'm just gonna get some stuff done real quick. But yeah, that's a little update. Okay guys, we're packed and ready to go. All of our stuff is in the car. You guys, Taylor's eating her dinner because she just got off work. And her spray tan, honestly, it doesn't, oh look, God, it doesn't look that bad on the, okay, no, it kinda does. <laughs> um, Taylor's an interesting spray tan, but guys, she just, she hasn't washed it off yet. So that's why it looks the way it does. Um, but judge me for it. we have a three and a half hour drive and it's almost eight o'clock, so let's get it. Woo! But we're off to LA. I'm so excited. I'm so happy to oh, have yeah. oh. no marketing. Sorry, I'm oh. listening to a potty. Well, a potty. <laughs> so, driving to Chicago tonight, going to the hotel, and then we fly out tomorrow at like 12 45. But I think I'm gonna end this vlog. No, maybe I'll vlog in the hotel a little bit. You'll maybe that'll be. Or, will that be like the start of our next vlog? I don't know. If it's not, thanks for watching. I love you so much. Thanks for prepping for LA with us. Thanks for coming along. I feel <laughs> like I was there the whole time. You too. were. You literally were. This is the prep with Taylor and I. Oh, perfect. Yeah. So <laughs> now we're going to drive. Wish us luck. Okay, bye. Bye. Love you guys. <laughs>